What's up everybody, it's Alfredo Cognati. And listen, if you're looking to build big triceps, then you gotta train smart. We're not just talking about hitting the gym and going through the motions. I'm gonna give you the inside scoop on how to maximize your tricep growth so you can finally fill out those sleeves. We're gonna break down the best tips and exercises, and I'm gonna give you all the cues to make sure you're doing them right. No more wasted workouts, no more plateauing, just pure tricep gains. Are you ready? Let's do this. All right, before we even think about lifting heavy, we gotta get those triceps warmed up and ready to work. Remember, we're trying to build muscle, not get injured, right? So, we're gonna start with some light movements to increase blood flow and get the joints loose. Think about it like this. You wouldn't just hop into your car on a freezing day and slam on the gas without letting it warm up first, right? Same goes for your body. We gotta treat it with respect. So, we'll start with some arm circles, forward and backward, nice and controlled, then we'll move into some tricep extensions using just our body weight, nothing crazy, just enough to get those muscles firing and prepared for the real work ahead. Now it's time to crank things up a notch with the close grip bench press. This exercise is not just any ordinary lift. It's a powerhouse move that targets your triceps like no other. This exercise is a staple for building those horseshoe triceps, and for good reason. It's a go-to for anyone serious about arm strength and definition. It allows you to really overload the muscles with weight, leading to some serious growth. The more weight you can handle, the more your triceps will respond and grow. Now the key here is in the name, close grip. This specific grip is what sets this exercise apart from the standard bench press. We're gonna bring those hands in closer than a standard bench press, about shoulder width apart. This adjustment shifts the focus directly onto the triceps. This ensures that the triceps are doing the brunt of the work. You'll feel the burn right where you want it. As you lower the bar, keep those elbows tucked in close to your body and focus on squeezing those triceps at the top of the movement. This technique maximizes muscle engagement. Remember, we're not just trying to move the weight, we're trying to feel those triceps working. Every rep should be controlled and deliberate. Control the weight on the way down, explode up and squeeze at the top. This combination of control and power is what will lead to impressive tricep development. Chapter 3, Tricep Dips Unleash Your Inner Beast. Next up, we're hitting those triceps with some bodyweight brutality tricep dips. This exercise is a staple in any serious fitness routine. Don't let the simplicity of this exercise fool you. It's a killer for building both strength and size in those triceps. It's all about form and control. Find yourself some parallel bars or even a sturdy chair will do, and let's get to work. The key is to ensure stability and safety. Lower yourself down slowly, keeping your body upright and your elbows tucked in. This controlled descent is crucial for targeting the triceps effectively. Once you feel a good stretch in those triceps, push yourself back up, focusing on using the strength of your triceps to lift you. Engage your core for added stability. Now here's a little tip to really maximize this exercise. At the top of the movement, hold that contraction for a second or two. This pause can make a big difference. This will really intensify the burn and promote growth. Feel the muscles working and embrace the challenge. Remember, quality over quantity, so focus on that mind-muscle connection and really feel those triceps working. Consistency and proper form are key to seeing results. Chapter 4. Overhead, tricep extension, sculpting those horseshoes. All right, let's isolate those triceps even further with the overhead tricep extension. This exercise is all about targeting those long heads of the triceps, giving you that coveted horseshoe look. You can use a dumbbell or a cable machine for this one, whichever you prefer. The key is to keep your upper arms locked in place, close to your ears, and focus on using just the triceps to extend the weight overhead. Control the weight on the way down, feel that stretch in the triceps, and then extend powerfully back up, squeezing at the top. Remember we're all about control and precision here, so no swinging the weight or using momentum. Keep it strict, keep it focused, and those triceps will thank you. Chapter 5. Consistency is key rest and recover. Now listen up, because this is crucial. You can do all the exercises in the world, but if you're not training consistently and allowing your muscles to recover, you're not going to see the results you're after. Consistency in your workout routine is just as important as the exercises themselves. Think of your muscles like a sponge. If you keep squeezing a dry sponge, you're not going to get much water out of it, right? It's the same with your muscles, they need to be replenished. But if you let that sponge soak up some water, it can hold a lot more. This soaking process is akin to your muscles recovering and rebuilding. Your muscles are the same way. They need time to rest, rebuild, and grow stronger after a tough workout. They need time to rest, rebuild, and grow stronger after a tough workout. This recovery phase is where the real magic happens. So, make sure you're getting enough sleep, eating a balanced diet, and staying hydrated. These elements are crucial for muscle recovery and giving your body the time it needs to recover between workouts. Incorporate rest days and active recovery techniques like foam rolling or light stretching. Remember, consistency is key, both in your training and in your recovery. 
Keeping a workout log can help you stay on track and monitor your progress. Stay consistent, stay dedicated, and those triceps will keep on growing. Your dedication to both exercise and recovery will pay off in the long run. So, there you have it guys, the best tips and exercises to grow those triceps fast. Remember, it's not just about lifting heavy, it's about lifting smart. Focus on proper form, control the weight, and really feel those triceps working with every rep. And don't forget about the importance of warming up, resting, and giving your body the fuel it needs to recover and grow. Now I want to hear from you. Which one of these tips are you going to focus on first? Let me know in the comments below and let's get those triceps pumped.